It means you can't get stuck with a vehicle you don't want. Let's say you have a certain... You ask him. Oh. Okay. I'm sorry. We're, we're, we're role-playing. You're the customer. Okay. I'm the sales guy. Okay. <laughs> so what does the 72-hour exchange mean to me? It means you can't get stuck with the wrong vehicle. You know, Troy, um, have you ever been to a department store or Best Buy or Home Depot or someplace, purchased something, got it home, decided it wasn't right, and uh, you took it back and exchanged it? Yeah. Okay. Um, any good retailer will let you do that, but car dealers don't let you exchange vehicles, do they? No. No, not for the most part. But here at County Ford, look, we don't want you getting stuck with the wrong vehicle. And you can't get stuck with the wrong vehicle because we're going to give you basically a three-day test drive. Because during the first three days, should you decide that the color, the equipment, the seat doesn't feel right. Your dog just starts barking at it, it won't stop. It doesn't matter. During those first three days, if you decide the vehicle's not right for you, you can bring it back and not a, not trade it in. Any dealer will let you do that. You take a financial bath when that happens. You can bring it back here and exchange it for another. Now, three things. Number one, the policy is in writing. Number two, there are two conditions. Condition number one, we ask that you don't put more than 300 additional miles on the odometer. Condition two, you need to bring it back in the same condition it left in. Now, has any dealer ever made that commitment to you before and put it in writing? No. That's what we do here at County Ford. Now, if I don't think I can get stuck with the wrong vehicle and I know I can't pay too much, does that make it easier for me to say yes? Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's what this whole thing's about. In fact, your whole the, the whole selling profession is about making it easier for the customer to say yes. If you do a really good meet and greet, all right, and they take a liking to you right off the bat, it's going to make it easier for the customer to say yes. If you help the customer pick out the right vehicle um, by asking the right questions, the right vehicle is a vehicle they both want, need, and can afford. It makes it easier for them to say yes. If you do a good job of showing off the vehicle, it makes it easier for them to say yes. If you take them on a good demonstration drive, it makes it easier for them to say yes. This whole program is designed to make it easier for your customer to say yes. At the Nissan store you worked at, um, what was the value proposition? Do you know what a value proposition is? Uh, yeah, well, I just, I just call it our niche, but uh, we were the only dealership that um, gave you a lifetime Limited Lifetime warranty. limited powertrain warranty, okay? okay? Yeah. By the way, that was cool in 1999, <laughs> 98, that was cool, 88. okay? <laughs> By the way, where's that warranty good? At the dealership. At the dealership. Yeah. No, where was it good? Oh, oh, at our dealership, yeah. At your dealership, okay? Um, but, that, but you know what a value proposition, that's good. This value proposition blows mm -hmm. every. Well, I'm, we've just I'm, we're just touching on a few of the points. Wait till we get into it deeper. When you can communicate, whether it's the County Advantage or the Motor Trend Certified Program to the customer, um, your closing ratio will go up. Your gro your gross profit will go up. Your commissions will go up. But there is not just an art to it. There's a science to it as well. Okay, so. Um, why is a, what's a, why is a certified pre-owned vehicle a better vehicle? Because of the inspection, thorough inspection and reconditioning process. And reconditioning process, okay. What sort of warranty comes with it, Brian? Uh, it comes with the motor trend. Uh, that doesn't mean shit to me. What do you mean? What kind of warranty comes with it? Limited, uh, comprehensive warranty. And is it one of those warranties that doesn't cover anything? It covers anything that's not wear and tear. So it, not cool. anything. It covers most of the mechanical workings of the vehicle. Okay? Um, can I pay too much? No. No. Why can't I pay too much? It's the best value guarantee. And how's that work again? Um, you, if you find a lower advertised price in the same car with the same benefits within five days, we'll refund 100% of the difference. And where can I look? 
uh, anywhere, you know, anywhere in the United nice States, thing. online, you can shop in person. Can I look at uh, Craigslist? Yes. <laughs> can I look at used car used car websites? Yes. New car websites? Yes, yes. And Tiffany, can I get stuck with the wrong vehicle? Absolutely not. Why? Because, because of the guarantee. Uh, because if you don't like it, Steve, bring some bitch back and exchange it for another. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. We're looking at this side of the card right now. Complimentary maintenance for three years. What does that mean, Cameron? <clears throat> so you got your oil changes up every 7,500 miles, tire rotations, plus you've got the free safety inspections for when you get ready to go on a trip you can call schedule um, and they'll take a look at it they'll do the thorough inspection to make sure everything's in working condition top off the fluids how many uh, oil changes and tire rotations do i get four four, four. four. roughly works out roughly about every 7500 miles which is great because with all the synthetic blends that's what they're saying you can run those two instead of the old 3000 miles you want to add anything to it you got it for the most part. Tiffany, you want to add anything to it? Well, I want you to add something to it. You're right. It sounded very nice. Thank you. But um, do people in this area give a shit about money? Yes. How much money is that saving? Oh. Me? Oh yeah. There you go. A lot. What, what's the what's the oil change? Eighty five bucks. What, what's, what's, what's the re, what's the yeah, what's the retail oil change here? With the, with the I know it'll depend on the vehicle. Let's say yeah. I buy a uh, an Explorer. What's the retail uh, oil change? One ten. Oil change and tire rotation. Yeah, yeah, yeah one twenty. I think it's what the number we used the other day is one hundred twenty. What is it? Eighty nine. Ninety. So ninety bucks. Ninety bucks. Yeah. Here's what I don't want to do. I don't, I don't want to exaggerate anything to the customer, because if the customer knows. That it's ninety bucks, and I say one hundred and twenty. I just lied. Where, 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 what, what, you what's happened it. to my credibility? You lost, you lost it. Just lost it. Nothing else I say is going to have any credibility. So, and by the way, um, if you give me five, in fact, uh, Stephen bought me lunch today, and I liked him a lot. I'm going to guess it was a ten or twelve dollar lunch. If you give me a three hundred and sixty dollars worth of oil changes and tire rotations, I like you a lot. Okay, so quantify it. Resist all. <sighs> Tiffany, what is resist all? That is the protects the leather or it protects the vehicle against things such as um, coffee stains, um, markers, tears. <laughs> I think that's right. Brian, what's resist all? Resist all. Why, why, would I, why, why would I care? I've never had resist all before. Why would I give a shit now? Because it helps protect your vehicle and the coating of the paint from the outside. From yeah. bird droppings, acid rain, or let's say you want to fit it in one day, it kind of help, helps keep that value of the paint. There's the magic words right there. So there's a dollar value to this, right? Yes, sir, there is. Hey, Sebastian, um, let's say that Courtney and I bought a car five years ago same car mm -hmm. Courtney got resist all I didn't we come to trade them in you're appraising them okay same exact same vehicle same miles which one's worth more the one that had the resist all. how much based on the quality of the way it looks versus mine how much more might it be worth $1,500 Think about. It. I mean, what he's telling you is the absolute truth. The same car, same miles, to the same tire condition. Everything's the same except one's paint doesn't have loss of gloss, doesn't have acid rain damage, doesn't have bird dropping damage, tree sap. On um, the interior, as uh, Tiffany pointed out, um, is spick and span. Peter, you know, guys, know you don't even know what that means, do you? <laughs> I do. Yeah. I appreciate the fact that he doesn't think I'm old enough to know what that means. Um, the interior.